Whether you know much about motorcycles or not, this was a very interesting place to learn a little bit about some of the oldest motorcycles around. Uh, what you're seeing are bikes from two individuals' collections that make up most of what's in this museum. And then there are about 40 other bikes that are um, interspersed with the, the ones from the two large collectors. Um, there's no cost to get into the museum. They ask for a donation. And um, the person running the front counter was very knowledgeable, was able to tell us a lot about the bikes and the owners of the bikes. Um, there is a vault to store seven of the most rare bikes that are in the collection. And you'll see those um, towards the end of the video. Um, this was in St. Francis, Kansas. Um, who would have expected something like this to be in a place in the middle of pretty much nowhere? But um, we had a good time, and we were very glad that we stopped in to see this um, motorcycle museum. For my motor motorcycle enthusiast friends, in this vault in the Motorcycle Museum in St. Francis, Kansas, are some of the one-of-a-kind bikes, probably rarest bikes in the U.S. One-of-a-kind, one-of-a-kind, maybe one of five, one of three, Anyway, pretty cool place. A little more video from the inside of the Motorcycle Museum in St. Francis, Kansas. Most of these bikes are owned by two individuals 
with some others sprinkled in. Hundred and fifty thousand dollars to Interesting place to visit if you're ever in Goodland, St. Francis, Kansas. Here's the other side of the rows of and motorcycles. So he had that so it would, he couldn't lay this curve down. In the motorcycle museum in St. Francis, Kansas. He raced it up there.